Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So we've made some good progress on our second floor. We've got all of the joists and the floor sheathing up on this portion of the house. So we've got it over the kitchen and the dining room right here behind me. So what we're working on right now is we're getting the rest of the joists across this direction on this side of the house. And um, then we'll work on all the blocking and sheathing. So we've got a few steps in the process, kind of similar to the first floor but um, up there we've got a nice deck now that we've got some of the floor sheathing on so I'll go over and show you here in a minute um, the incredible view that we have it's a bit hazy today but we've got a great view of the mountains on a clear day and um, we're making some good progress on our second sub floor so I'll show you kind of what we're working on so welcome to the second floor of our house. So up here, we just moved some lumber up here so that we got the joists here easy to work with. But as you can see, we've got the floor sheathing on on this side of the house. And now what he's working on right now is getting the floor joist on over here. And we'll have to do those all the way across on this side as well as the far side across the way we need our joists over here and then once we've got the joists in and all the blocking done we'll put the floor sheathing on over there as well so uh, we're moving along pretty quickly and as you can see, we've got the hangers are already up along the beam. So that's where each joist is gonna go. Um, and then right here in this spot, right here, there's no hangers because that is where we have a two story space for where the stairs go up to the second floor. So you can't see it today, it's a bit hazy. So I'll have to get it another day for you guys. Um, the view from up here is pretty amazing. Um, when it's not so hazy, you can see the mountains really well. So it's gonna be quite the view all the way around from the upper floor. Um, so pretty exciting stuff over here. So over here on this side, what he's working on is he's got the rim board over there cut. So he's gonna take the rim board and put it on the outside of those joists and get everything nailed in. And then once he's got the rim boards all in, cause he has the one here on this side, the rim board is in. So he's getting that far side. And then once he's got the rim board in, he can nail all of the joists in to the rim board and put in the blocking. And then once we have all the blocking, we are good for adding sheathing to this portion of the house. So right here, you can see there's the top of our big 24 inch beam that I was talking about. Um, and we haven't put the sheathing on right here in this section, even though these joists are all in, is because um, the next four by eight sheet of plywood OSB floor sheathing is gonna go over that beam. So it's gonna be on these joists here. So we have to get those joists nailed in before we can move on and get the, the sheathing on that portion. But as you can see, that's looking down into our living room area and then across the way, the other side of our second floor. So that's what we're working on right now. So while my dad Ron is putting up the floor joists for the second floor, my husband over here, um, this is Cam, my husband. I know you've seen him in a few videos, kind of in the background. Um, but what he's working on right now is, so one of the things we have to do structurally, um, both at the first level and the second level, is install these metal straps. So these metal straps have to go 14 inches up um, 
on the floor at each location where there is two or more joists or two or more studs excuse me so he has to take it so right now what the one he's working on right now is on the cantilever so it can't connect to the sill plate but um, it has to go from the bottom all the way up 14 inches above the floor so that it ties the wall to the rim board and the floor joists and all that. So he's gotten a few of them in here. Um, and so we've got these, we have to do these all the way around on the first floor. And then once we get the second floor walls up, we will have to do the same thing on the second floor. So these are just metal straps that help tie everything together is what these are. Why don't you take it out on me? 